Hey guys, to have a brand new LEGO review. Today we have the LEGO The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, Riddles for the Ring. Awesome. So this is a semi-new set from the LEGO The Hobbit line. Set 79000, and it features Bilbo Baggins and Gollum. So, yeah, 105 pieces. It retails for $9.99, I think, but at Toys R Us it's $12.99. So, yeah, do with that what you will. And it's a really small box, but because it's a small set. Packaging wise, you can see The Hobbit. And then you got Bilbo, you got Gollum, you got Sting, Lego. Actually says Bilbo Baggins and Gollum. On the back, you've got some of the fantastical things you can do in the set. Like, open the thing to reveal the ring. Have Gollum stand there. Have that thing. And have Gollum attack Bilbo Baggins. On the side, it also has translations such as Le Hobbit, un voyage in a tindu, Or El Hobbit, un voyage in esperado. So, yeah. Since it's a small set, it's going to be easy to do. So, let's begin. Here we have the riddles for the ring. We might as well start off with the minifigs. So the first minifigure in the set is Bilbo Baggins. In the movie, Bilbo Baggins is played by Martin Freeman, who was also in Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Pretty good detailing. I really like his little coat, button-up, and stuff going on. Back detailing. He's got short legs because he's a hobbit. And it's very, very cute. He's got hair. It's the same as Frodo and Sam and all the other hobbits. And there's back there's a alternate face. So he gets screaming instead of being err. And he comes accessorized with Sting. So that's pretty neat. Next up, we have Gollum. 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 Gollum is the exact same figure as the one that came in the Shalab attacks in Lord of the Rings, just with a different face. I've seen pictures of it, and I think I prefer that one more. I don't know why. But yeah, it looks like Gollum. It's very nice, though his crotch thing isn't painted all the way around. But I don't think it needs to be, so that's good. He's got a little peg. And he comes accessorized with a fish. 
All right, let's get on to the actual set. Gollum has this little boat thing that he can ride. See those bones and stuff? It's in the movie. And it looks okay. But when Gollum's in, he can't really hold his fishy. Or can he? Oh, he can hold his fish. Never mind. So he's good. So he's meant to just kind of ride on that. Serving USA. And now we can get onto the actual, actual part of the set. This big old rock. That's the set. I mean, it looks alright. It's just some rock patterns. These little things here are articulated. You can slide them in. Or slide them all the way out. The box has them kind of angled. These extra colors just kind of stick out at the back. And there's an action feature. Watch this. Whoa! That's literally the action feature. Amazing. And look! The set comes with a ring. You know, the one ring to rule them all, the one ring to find them, the one ring to bring them all, and in the darkness bind them? Whoa! So let's get it out of the set. If I can get it out. So here is the ring. It's just a ring. You can give the ring to Bilbo and be like, huh? Where'd he go? Wh wh where'd he go? Oh my god! 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 Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! That ring actually works. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. It looks like that. And the oddest part... The set came with two of them. So, that's cool. But you can't really recreate the scene that this is meant to be, because, spoiler alert, click here to avoid the spoiler, but it's not really a spoiler, because The Hobbit, Unexpected Journey is part one, so it's not really a spoiler. I don't know. Anyway, click here to avoid this. This scene is based off of near the end, Bilbo gets lost from the journey party, and finds Gollum. And he also finds the ring on the ground, and he's lost. So he goes to Gollum, and they have a riddle to help him out. And so they have a couple of riddles, and then Bilbo's like, what's in my pocket? And Gollum is like, Baggins! Baggins! I can't, I can't do a Gollum. But yeah, that happens. Something around that. <laughs> and then he uses the ring and escapes. So, overall, that was the Lego, The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, set number 79000, Riddles for the Ring. It's a good set, I like it. The price is really good for what you get. I think it rounds out to like 10 cents per piece or 11 maybe, I'm not sure. You get two really nice figures, you get an exclusive version of Gollum, you get Bilbo who's in a couple other sets, but it's nice to get him in a cheap set. And the rock is okay. And you get the ring, so... It's a good deal for what you get. Anyway, did you like the video? Well, then write, comment, subscribe, and like, and I'll see you later. Oh, something else to mention before I go. It came with an extra sting. That's awesome.